Hello and welcome to another permanent ankle shackle vlog. As you can see written on the left sole of my foot, this is 48 days. I've been permanently shackled 48 days. These shackles are locked on with permanent uh, rivets, steel rivets. I can't remove them. I don't have the tools to remove them and they are staying on for another 52 days. So I'm still waiting for the new barefoot rule that my uh, third party is going to implement. Um, but if I had to guess, and you know, I have nothing better to do all day but guess at what's gonna happen. Um, and this makes perfect sense. It would be, I mean, there's really not that many options there. He tells me that the new rule will guarantee that I can't wear footwear during the, the two year period. And he did, prep, he did mention without permission. So that does let me think that um, under the new rules and, and punishments that he's going to be adding, there will be an option in there for him to give me permission temporarily. And that's a good thing because, you know, I don't mind going barefoot in the summer and I, I go barefoot all the time anyway. Um, I usually put flip flops on when I go into a store or something. But if I have to go barefoot into a store in the middle of summer, not a huge problem. Um, it's just the winter. That I have my major issue with. So if I guess what his new rules are going to be, will be a, a ban on footwear. He will confiscate anything that I can wear on my feet and take it from the property. Um, and that's sort of along the lines of the shackling where he's taking the tools so I can't remove them. If he takes my footwear, I don't have the option to wear footwear. And putting a ban on it um, with a really long punishment will ensure that I don't just order a pair of flip flops off, off of Amazon. Similar to my shackling policy where I, if I can't just order a drill and get them off. Um, and I'm guessing he'll, you know, he's gonna put this in two parts. He'll probably have a one year extension on the footwear ban. So if, I, if I'm in possession of footwear at any time and he'll be able to, he already has the right to come into my house and do searches and inspections and whenever he wants, anytime, day or night. Luckily, he hasn't interrupted my sleep on that one yet. Um, if he comes in, finds footwear, I, I'm guessing he'll probably add a one-year extension, um, and that'll be with chains, not the you know the what he did for me on the two-year without chains, uh, shackles without chains, um, and then wearing footwear will be another one year. Uh, I'm sure he's going to extend that from the 30 days, or is it 60? I don't know. There's so much in the contract. I, I get all the all the punishments confused because I'm not really planning on breaking them. So I don't really put a lot of thought into what the what the punishments are because I you know don't plan on you know being punished. But uh, whatever it is now, 30 or 60 days for wearing shoes, um, he'll probably extend that to one year. So if I am caught wearing shoes under this new plan that I think he's going to implement, I will probably be shackled and chained for two years the same punishment that I would if I took the shackles off. So um, this is all part of the revision contract. Uh, the, the mode that we're in right now is revision um, based on the previous uh, change that he made uh, granting me uh, two years with shackles without chains, which is put me in that precarious uh, situation where uh, he can do whatever he wants now. He can add punishments, he can add rules, and I have to follow him. There, I have no say in it. Um, he has absolute 100% control over me now, um, to, to some degree. Now, if he starts implementing rules that uh, are worse than being chained for two years, then um, I can always revert back to the, uh, the base mode of the contract and then do my two years in chains. Um, but obviously, I don't want to do that. So um, as long as he adds rules and punishments that are better than that, then he can basically make me do whatever I want, whatever he wants. Um, so, but anyway, I'm, I'm babbling on again. So, so on the topic of questions and answers, um, I get questions and answers. I mean, I get questions all the time and comments and things like that. And that's great. I love it. Um, you have to realize that I am literally chained up and imprisoned in my house. I really have no life right now. So <laughs> I, people asking, I mean, well, my life is being sh shackled and chained. So if you have questions about my life, I'm more than happy to answer them because I really have nothing to do all day except for think about my situation. And uh, in fact, if you ask a question, you'll probably get 
a far too long answer. Based on the vlog, you know I can get a little long-winded, and I'll probably give you maybe a little bit too much information. So <laughs> don't worry about messaging me uh, and commenting and, and all that. I mean, you can actually email me through my blog. So if you go to uh, shackledbarefeet.wordpress.com, we can open up a dialogue in email. And I'm, I'm perfectly happy going back and forth all day long. As long as you have questions, I have answers. I'll, I'll be replying with them. So um, don't, don't be shy. You know, don't think you're bothering me. I am literally a prisoner right now. <laughs> there's, there's nothing for me to do but answer your questions. So um, bring them on. Um, but anyway, uh, on that point, uh, be sure to just comment on, on my uh, videos. Uh, like, subscribe, share, and uh, again, go to my vlog. I post a lot on the blog. Uh, sorry, I said vlog. On my blog, uh, shackledbarefeet.wordpress.com. I'm posting there like every day, and I usually uh, post information there before you'll see it in these vlogs, because um, these vlogs are uh, about a day and a half behind. So anyway, I will see you tomorrow for day 49. I can't believe I'm almost halfway through my first 100 days. Uh, I might have to do something special on the day 50. Give me an idea what I should do. Maybe a walking video, maybe outside, I don't know. But anyway, I'll see you tomorrow for day 49, and thanks for watching.